previously at the Glory Revival. This woman had a tumor that caused nerve pain so excruciating that she couldn't look at lights. Listen to what happened after one prayer. I hear someone say, Ma'am, is it okay if I pray for you? And I said, okay. And she starts praying. And then all of a sudden, I felt the energy. And that energy started to sway a little fast. And I thought, oh, wait a minute. Something's happening. And then when she finished, she touched the very spot and said, Ma'am, how do you feel now? And the burning that was down my back, I didn't feel any burning. And I tilted my head back and I looked directly into the light. I go through my house every day and I flip on every light. During a moment of spontaneous worship with revivalist Nelson, an angel ministers to this young boy, and his deliverance led to the salvation of his entire family. Stretch your hands towards the little one right now. The Lord is touching him. It began with your miracle, but now it's the whole family in Jesus' name. Revivalist Nelson identifies by word of knowledge that the woman's husband was in a car wreck, causing back problems and uneven legs. Watch as the Holy Spirit performs a miracle through Revivalist Nelson's anointed handkerchief. get your tongues as you're praying for her. You ready? She was filled as she healed. So from one to ten in size, where was it? Where is it now? This one is probably a four and this one's a three. Somebody say all the way down. Now, this message applies to every area of life. What do you have? Put it in you for a reason. The nobleman, the, the, the king, God, deposited it in you. He's expecting a return on that investment. But your gift is useless if it's buried. He gave what she had and was given more. What do you have? Start serving it now. 